Okay. This is our Korean Svin Awi heat press machine, 38 size centimeter by 38 size centimeter size. It's the control panel, power, fuse, and the control box. And this is a heating page. <coughs> it can move away 270 degree and totally around. And this is the bottom plate, sleeping pipe, and this is my aluminum plate, bottom plate. First, we have to tell you how to adjust the pressure. First, we need to loosen this button by clockwise, anti clockwise, do this button. You can say it can move. This is pressure adjustment. If we clockwise do it, the pressure will be decreased. Decrease like this. Uh, the, uh, you can see the bottom plate will, will just uh, fall down, so the pressure can be decreased. If we, we anti clockwise do it, the, the pressure will be increased. The bottom plate lift up. Okay. And uh, if we want to try the pressure, just press this button. If we feel the hand a little hard to push it, push it uh, down, then the pressure will be okay. Okay, the pressure is still not enough. Okay, just like this. Okay, now it's okay. Now, if we want to uh, fasten this, we have to make sure this plate and this bottom plate is parallel in one line and you can feel it by press this a little and just like this okay it's parallel in one line now we can fasten the button by roll this button okay the pressure is fixed now we move push it away and display this fabric on the bottom remember every plate must be <coughs> Our plate must be very smooth. Okay, and this is the summation paper. The paper should face down to the fabric. Okay, then we move it here. We can see the control box here. You can see it's the three in one control function. Is the first we press this button, we can say P, file P means temperature setting mode. Now we can press this up idle to increase temperature and this down idle to decrease temperature. Normally we use it 220 degree for submission transfer. And then we press this button second time. File P, file reverse F means time setting mode. Now we can press this up idle to increase time and this down idle to decrease time. And then we press this ST button second, third time. The setting is finished. You can see it's the counter. Once we finish one time printing, it will count one time. If you want to clean it up, we have to press this button for about five seconds. It will blink and then turn to zero. You can see it's blinking because it's no number, so it's still zero. Okay, finished. Now we just push it here and press down the this handle, you can see the counter just come, come down automatically. Once it's finished, the, the machine will ring a sound to remind you the printing is finished. Then you can take away the other product. Okay, it's finished. We push it here to the top and move it aside. Okay, you can see the printing is very beautiful. Very clear and really beautiful and bright. Thank you.